What's up guys, Iceface here, and we're on Valor Legends once again, so today's video we're going to be doing our free red room to start it off from the loot store. We're going to go ahead and exchange for our free random red room. What do you think we're going to get? Let me know. <clears throat> we're going to do these seeds first, but let me know in the comment section what you think we're going to get. Try to give it some good luck with the uh, the prerequisiting seed summons to give me a four star epic hero. So now, what are we gonna get? Okay, red salvations. Okay, we don't have the dust anyway to um, disassemble. And reassemble. So, what we're going to do is, for the most part, change this for this. And then we can transition this one here. And I believe that's. That's that for the minute, guys. Um, uh, yeah. So, we got a red salvation rune. Um, I mean, it's a pretty good rune. You know, like, if you get it level 4, it's, the healing effect is increased by 54% when own allies' HP is below 50%. So, as soon as she hits that 50% mark, the healing's going to go up by 54%. So, 54% increase of healing done is quite good. Um, it could be better, but, you know, I, I mean, it, this is the sort of room that I don't mind dismantling. If it is to upgrade the upper hand, for example. But we can actually just purely purchase them ones out so it doesn't matter too much but again it would have been nice to get another upper hand but it's a free room so you can't complain too much um the purple one is gonna go somewhere um I need to wait for these to reset for Olivia. But, yeah. So, we've got the red rune. Um, I just want to go over some little tips quickly, guys, today. While this new update is so fresh in the minds. Um, we're going to have a Michaela video coming out as well. But this was about the red rune today and some new UI stuff. So, in the Glory Arena, guys, you're going to notice that there is different methods of attacking now. So, you've got multiplayer challenge. Where you can actually select who you want to fight. And you can do it for free. So I can do all of these for free. And I just click free. And it's going to show me all of these different attacks. Which ones I gained points for. which one, How much they lost. And as you can see it's pumped me up. Just a little bit. So that is pretty cool. Um, the same sort of situation in the advanced arena. I believe someone's been fighting with me. This guy has. Unfortunate for him. So you can now actually skip formations. If I try find. So. You can see I don't have to. Eye up any of my teams. But I only did it with this guy. Because I know I can beat him easily. And I don't have to think about it. So that's cool. Um, saves you a little bit of time there. We've actually got a. New reward as well for hitting platinum free, so that's pretty, pretty groovy. Um, Twenty nine thousand. So we're actually going to save up for the time being. I preferred the old advanced arena tokens look to this. I don't know about you guys. I just, I definitely did prefer it. But moving on anyway, swiftly. 
that is the main things that have changed. Like, the arena is a little bit more optimised with this multiplayer challenge, but at the same time, if I wanted to hit the same guy multiple times, so, like, I don't know, we got we got Sudden Strike as well. I'm not sure what the difference is between Sudden Strike and Free. I'm not sure. Baku's at 300 now, nice. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, I guess Sudden Strike, I don't see the formations either. But it's asking me for, okay. Well, you know, I guess if you know you can beat people, then it's not too much of a big deal. But if you're not sure if you can beat someone, that would be kind of annoying, no? Um, if you click it by mistake. Also, in the Mysterious Realm, there is this sweep all feature, but there is, it, it costs gems, so, spend 250 gems to buy sweep and sweep all instances once. Good value, to be honest, the 250 one, and then, of course, we just come to the Nest of Dragons and we want to do that maximum times. But the new sweet features are pretty cool as well. Um, if you didn't watch my previous video, we did Nightmare. We haven't actually advanced in these yet either. We did start one, but we haven't advanced any further. Because we're kind of waiting to see if you guys want to see each one done. I don't believe you will because they are fairly straightforward to do. Um, I might do a video off of all of the books that I gained from the event. But I'll be doing that on Ice Phase because he's got more books being saved up there than on this Fire Phase because, like I said before, Fire Phase is pushing for Guild Wars Heavy. So That being said, guys, I hope you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, do smash the like button. Let us know what you think about the Red Salvation Rune. Is it worth it? I mean, I've got it for free. So let me know. Subscribe to the channel to never miss out on the daily valor legends content and that being said i will see you all on the next one peace out everyone have a good day